New video from Estes Park. Seven News making the trip into Larimer County to check on flood recovery. You can see the wildlife seems unfazed by the damage that still remains along Fall River. But all that debris is worrying the humans in town. The town administrator is telling us he has two concerns this spring, and there are sandbags at the ready. I think there's some areas that were damaged during the flood that when the water comes back up, it'll, the, it'll just pick up where it left off. So we're working on those emergency sites to get them taken care of. And then there's some places that a lot of silt came down and where the water slowed down, it uh, piled up. So getting the silt out of there so there's capacity for the river to handle it when the normal runoff comes on down in a few weeks. Work also underway to repair roads like this one, which is now only one lane. And what's still floating in Boulder Creek also cause for concern. City and county leaders closing the creek so crews can start removing debris like this in some areas there are trees and concrete blocks still in the waterway, and the city says this all comes down to safety. We look at the public safety issue. Do you want to be tubing down Boulder Creek and get caught on some rebar and be seriously injured and go to the hospital? So this means those of you who like to go tubing, kayaking, and swimming in Boulder Creek won't be allowed right now. If you want to jump in anyway, you face a $1,000 fine or 90 days in jail.